Okay, y'all, today we are talking about RGBP, or Region Biopharma, Inc., um, headquartered in La Mesa, San, uh, San Diego. La Mesa is a city, a city, a uh, suburb of San Diego. And, um, you know, I went, uh, I'm going to leave an uh, attachment to the last video I did on this. I actually went to their headquarters. And you guys, this is interesting. I'm going to unwind a, um, th this little thread. So if you own RGBP, you must watch this video through the end because there's some expose I'm going to be doing here. Okay, you guys, um, so if you look at the five-day chart, you know, they're doing great. I mean, it's up 66% over the last four days, and today it's probably going to be raising again, mostly because they filed a yearly end um, earnings report for September of 2020. And it had a couple of really interesting things in it. You know, they have a licensing agreement with Oncology Pharma, a, and a, um, another licensing agreement with Xander Therapeutics that started a little while ago. Now, you know, it's interesting that, you know, in their September uh, 2020 report, they're mentioning a licensing agreement that's uh, started in 20, 2021. Um, uh, okay, well, I mean, they're doing that just to, you know, kind of pump the stock a little bit, you know. But what's interesting is that, you know, in this uh, report, they mention a $1.2 million lawsuit for unpaid royalties uh, that they engaged with, with Xander Therapeutics, okay? So, you know, they licensed to Xander, and then, and, you know, now, uh, you know, Xander's suing them. Now, they're claiming that Xander owes them unpaid royalties, but, oh, no, 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 no. I'm going to unwind this mess in just a minute, you guys. So, we're going to finish up this statement real quick. Uh, they, they have an ongoing concern statement in their, um, uh, their September 2020 filing. They have zero cash, literally zero cash. Uh, but the, the big thing is that their liabilities are down from $7.2 million to $2.6 million, a decrease of 63% uh, year over year. That's really good. But again, here's the, you know, paid in capital. They had eight, eight you know, they need basically $8.2 million to operate annually. Um, and revenue is flat at 100 k And, <clears throat> you know, that, that's, that's, you know, that's, that's bad. Um, but anyway, net income. 3.4 million up from 26 2.6 million not really sure where this net income is coming from though because it's not coming from royalties from the or maybe it is but you know and if you look through you know the, the rest of this thing they're, they're playing i mean kind of a, a shell game regarding the loans it receives because it receives loans and then they're using that to pay off loans that the existing have i mean that's kind of what you do but Okay, so here's this is here's where it's interesting, you guys. In this report, here David Koo, CEO, Chairman, and Board of Region from 2012 to January 2020, and you know, and he, he's still, and now he's he's President, CEO, Treasurer, Secretary of Region. So, you know, all the roles were transferred to him, and if you look at this thing. K KCL Therapeutics, where they have one of the licensing deals, where you know they have. He's also CEO, President, Secretary, and Treasurer of that. But wait, <laughs> if you look at the uh, California Secretary of State filings for Xander Therapeutics, the company that's suing um, suing Regen Biopharma, guess who's the President, Secretary, and Treasurer of that company? David Coos. So David Coos is present secretary, treasurer, and you know, everything for for um, Xander Therapeutics. Xander Therapeutics, you know, engages in a licensing agreement with Region Biopharma, who's also run by, you know, run by David Coos. And then they go in and, you know, then they go in a licensing deal and then they sue each other. What? So David Coos runs all these companies and he's he's passing around, you know, fifty five grand here to there. You know, and then you know they, they get it, they get it, but it, it's a it, it's all owned by him. It's it's all a shell game. Okay. So here, let's let's find out. And and also, you know, in my last video I went to um, you know, David, you know, we're, you know, going to Region Biopharma's office, and and what you look there, Suite Three Hundred Four, it, it's, you know, um, BST Partners, 
Well, if you go and, and um, by the way, um, Regen rents space from BST Partners here. So if you look at BST Partners, well, who's the owner of that? <laughs> David Coos. Oh, and if you look at, if you look at Xander Therapeutics filing, guess, guess what their office is for California? BST Partners. You guys, this is, this is great. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Oh, what a joke. Anyway, you guys do what you want, but this is a joke. So if you look in the San Diego um, website, you to buy or sell any securities mentioned herein. I'm not a financial advisor.